Uh, this is the original mansion. It was the first Playboy Mansion. Um, it's a set. It was a 70 room classic French brick and limestone residence. Uh, uh, it was built in 1899 for Dr. George Isham. Uh, then in 1959, Hugh Hefner acquired it. Um, Hugh Hefner made uh, had a big open space basement. He called his grotto, and he had uh, he had a swimming pool made in there with uh, a glass wall. The door the door did have a brass plate on it with uh, a Latin inscription. Oh, hi, how are you? <laughs> um, of a Latin inscription. I don't know how to pronounce it. But it said, if you don't swing, don't ring. Um, uh, Hefner left permanently after being hassled over alleged cocaine usage by Illinois Governor uh, James R. Thompson. Um, they turned, they then turned this into a dormitory for the Art Institute of Chicago. And in 1993, the mansion was gutted and turned into a four high, a four high price luxury condo. Uh, in 2011, one condo was placed for sale at 6.7 million. And now this is for sale at, the whole mansion is for sale at the price of 14.5 million after they gutted it out again. So it's gutted out right now? No, they, they redid it, but they gutted it out again to redo it and then made it up for sale about 14.5 million dollars. Okay. Are there still any What? Are there still any What's in there now? Wait, what's there now? It's just furniture and all that stuff.